So I tried to get another Android 16 based custom rooms. Android 16 is here and many custom rooms adapting to Android 16. Some of the custom rooms are not actually officially available. So we can install a GSI for that. In this case, I'm using Dubfest OS as a GSI. And of course, if when whenever it will come as a custom room, I'll definitely make a video on that one too. But for now, available as a GSI, but as I just told you in my previous videos also, if you want to experience Android 16 right now, because you don't want to use it as a daily driver, you just want to experience the new UI or new features and so on, you can do so with the help of DSU side loader and without even wiping your device. If you want to install this thing, how you can, the installation video is available in the description. So make sure to check it out. So we have this Dubfest customization section, which brings you some customizations, although because it's based on Android 16, the UI is actually changed, but the features, customizations, unfortunately right now, while making this video, we do not have any major customizations available. If you move on to wallpapers and style UI, you will see the previous kind of Android 15 style wallpapers and, stu uh, wallpapers and style UI is here, nothing new. Because Android 16, the QPR update brings you new apply wallpaper UI. In this case, it's not implemented. And as far as I know, many custom rooms might not adapt to that until one or two months when that will come officially. For now, we have some tweaks available in this case. Like we have the support for taskbar. And yes, it's based on Android 16. So the new expressive UI is already here. The new, new quick settings panel is also, uh, also there. We'll talk about that later on. Uh, this is a GSI. So we have treble settings available, which depends upon you. If you are using it on a device, if you want to use it, if you want to experience it, try out some other things which are available in this case, you can. I never prefer the GSI as a daily driver because it is just for you to try out some new things, to experience some things for temporary time, temporary things, but don't use it as your primary and daily drive things. If you move on to some other options, you will see we have Monet personalization, which means custom theming is already a custom theming options are there. Also have some minor tweaks related to status bar options and uh, some other options included already in this case. If you see the miscellaneous options, you will see ignore window secure flags is fine and some privacy indicators and the load key box option, which means if you have any key box available, which you can use on your device to pass strong integrity and so on as it is a GSI. So it doesn't matter, but the part of this custom room, which I'll make a video on that later on very soon for sure. Quick settings panel is adapted to the latest Android 16 QPR update. After using Android 16 QPR officially on my Google Pixel device, I found that this quick settings panel and official Android 16 quick settings panel, which you are getting in QPR is a bit different. We have this blur intensity, high blur intensity in many custom rooms. So it looks good in some cases, in some cases it doesn't, but in stock Android, it is just so good in Pixel devices because I'm using that on my device. So yes, let's see in future, of course, whenever it will come officially, that will be quite exciting to see. But for now, this is it. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this video. We'll see you in the next one.